Hey, what did the vulture say when his friend invited him over for dinner? Uh, don't worry about it. I'll pick something up on the road. We're talking about vultures today. From the book, Did You Know About Zoos and Did You Know About Aquariums? A flip book written and illustrated by Tim Thomas. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and we're going to be right back with Vulture Facts right after this. Hey Ron, tell us the story. Vultures are large, short-tailed, solitary birds of prey. They are scavengers and have strong, gastric juices able to digest bones. Vultures feed on dead animals, also called carrion. And they have hook beaks which they use to tear flesh. Now males and females are similar in size and coloration and most have dark plumage, a short neck, weak feet and a featherless head and neck. The word buzzard is loosely applied to most raptors that are not owls, eagles or falcons but may include vultures and other condors. Did you know that a group of perched vultures is called a wake? A wake is a celebration of someone's life after they died and before they're buried. You can almost imagine a group of vultures mourning over something dead with their heads hung low over a dying animal or roadkill. Turkey vultures of America can locate their food using their acute sense of smell and keen eyesight. They have bald, red heads and dark feathers which resemble that of a wild turkey. The Latin word for turkey vulture is Cathares aura which means cleansing breeze. The male vulture is called a cock and turkey vultures average two and a half feet tall with a six foot wingspan. In spite of their large size, they only weigh between two and four pounds. The female vulture is called a hen and usually lays one or two eggs at a time. A baby vulture is called a chick and is white when it is born. And now it's time for croc jokes, my favourite part of the video. Why do vultures fly south in the winter? Because it's too far to walk. And what do you get when you cross a parrot with a vulture? You get a bird that'll talk your ear off. Back to the video. Other family group names are flock, committee or kettle and the sound a vulture makes is called a chuff. The term buzzard bait is used to describe a dying or worthless animal. If they have only the slightest hope of living we say on a wing in a prayer. Old buzzard is a slang phrase for an old man or woman who is usually mean to younger people. Now that's not nice. Be aware and care. Vultures serve an important function as nature's garbage collectors. They help to keep the environment clean of waste. You can show you care and help protect the vultures by making others aware why it's important to protect their habitats. These habitats must be preserved and pollutants eliminated so these important birds are not lost. And did you know? Vultures can soar for hours with only one beat of their wings. And that's today's story on vultures. Hope it wasn't too creepy for you. But I got one more question before you go. Where does a vulture go when he loses his tail? A retail store. I hope you guys had a lot of fun and if you liked that story, there's 31 more in the book Did You Know About Zoos and Did You Know About Aquariums? All the information is down below. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button and until next time, I'm off looking here and I'm looking there and looking everywhere for that next great story. So until I find it and come back, you guys have a great day, okay? Woohoo!